What's up guys, this is David coming to you from the Ultimate Survival Challenge in the endless mountains of North Central Pennsylvania where I asked my good friend and our primitive skills instructor, Clint Javoin, to show you guys how to make one of my favorite deadfall traps, the split stick figure four. Coming up next on Ultimate Survival Tips. So with the split stick figure four, the first step is to actually split the stick. So I've got this piece of maple here. I'm just gonna split this down the center using my knife. Okay. On one piece, I'm gonna need to make 45 degree angles. As I just sawed off a couple inches, so that makes my vertical done. This piece will be my diagonal. So the first thing I need to do to it is make a nice number seven notch. The next thing I need to do is put a 45 on each side. Now looks pretty good. So I've got two 45s and I've got a number seven notch. The last piece I need to make for my split stick figure four is the bait stick. Uh, I've just found kind of a narrow stick with a good, good six to eight inch straight piece. And that should be sufficient for this. I like to sharpen the ends of my bait stick. I feel like this lets me smear the bait in better. Um, and if you did have to use something like a berry, you'd be able to poke that on the end. The next step I need to do is to place the number seven notch on the end of the stick opposite of the point. Okay, so we'll just carve that out. The next thing I need to do is turn the stick a quarter of a turn and make a number seven notch that faces the opposite direction. It really only takes a few seconds to make that second notch, but that's gonna allow me to have more flexibility on what size deadfall I can set this trigger with. So there we have the full completed kit of the figure four deadfall. Let's go set our trap, guys. So yet again, guys, you guessed it. I'm gonna take a healthy amount of peanut butter there and I'm gonna peanut butter up. And I wanna really smear it into the stick I want this animal to really have to work for this. I don't want to give them any extra. I just want to really smear it into that stick. Here we go. You don't want any body part anywhere near the inside of this trap, guys. All right guys, so now we've got our trap set and this rock here is no joke. This is probably one of the bigger rocks I've set. Easily a 50, 60 pound rock. So we got it up. We need to make sure that we're not all of our work wasn't done in vain. We need to funnel it in around this trap so that the animal only has one point of entry and exit. All right guys, so I'm just gonna use what nature provided. I'm gonna take these rocks, I'm gonna put them all around this trap. Okay, I'm just gonna stack them to keep the animal only going out one direction. I don't want to interfere with the trap hitting the ground, but I do want to spend the time and I'm going to build these rocks all the way around this trap. I'm leaving my potential prey one way in and one way out, but I want to see to it that he doesn't get out. So we've got a completed split stick figure four deadfall here, about a 50, 60 pound rock. We're gonna go ahead and trip the trigger and just show you how much force this trap actually has. Our animal is gonna hopefully come in through here. He's gonna come in and get our bait. Hopefully we'll uh, we'll have a dead chipmunk, squirrel, something or another for dinner. 
For your convenience, I placed links to Clint's social media sites, along with some great resources on traps and snares, in the video description. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel on YouTube and the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV. For more tips, reviews, and to get your free subscription to our Survival EMAG, check out ultimatesurvivaltips.com. Okay, this is David. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you on the other side. And remember, be prepared because you never know. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. So I want to say if you're interested in attending our next Ultimate Survival Challenge Level 1, click the link over there or in the video description to learn more. So when I conceived the Ultimate Survival Challenge over three years ago, I designed it for folks like you and me who have limited time and money but want the most comprehensive survival training in the shortest amount of time possible. So in just three days, you'll be trained using primitive, hybrid, and modern survival techniques and gear. And once you're trained, you'll get to test yourself through a gauntlet of challenges that reinforce everything that you learned. And you'll have a chance to win a boss tricked out MSK-1 survival knife, and we're gonna give away a ton of other gear during the training. But best of all, the Ultimate Survival Challenge is a fun, encouraging, and family-friendly event designed for guys and gals of any skill level, ages 12 and up. Okay guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you and hang out at the next Ultimate Survival Challenge.